skipper David Peskid is once more taking on one of the deadliest ocean races in the world. His incredible crew of sailors with disabilities have battled the city to Hobart 17 times. They think they can, or they think they might be able to, or they think they'll have a go. And that's what we're about. It's about trying to get people to think, I can do this. I was 14 when I left school, and I left because it, it wasn't serving any purpose. Um, the, the main thing that the Department of Education had taught me that I was ignorant and dumb and couldn't learn. Um, so there wasn't much point in being there really. And about 18, I was um, examined by the TAFE system and found to be dyslexic. And of course that started a whole new process of who I was, what I was, where I was going to go. Sailing is a great venue for making new relationships and for people being challenged. And we're being challenged by an abstract, abstract concept. We're being challenged by the wind and the sea. It makes no quarter, you know. It doesn't know you haven't got an arm or a leg or can't read or write. SWD is a not-profit volunteer organisation. Since 1994, 40,000 people have participated in our free programs. Why do we do it? We do it because we want to build a more optimistic Australia. We have sailing programs for disabled children, for disadvantaged children, for young youth, for carers, for the mums and dads. One of our newer programs is the Winds of Change program, which is about getting disadvantaged youth together on the boat with some of our mentors and showing them how they can live their life, how they can make better choices in their lives. Um, I can sell, and Sharon here has um, taught me that, like, and all of us, all of us at John Byrne for Year 9 this year 2014, that we're all part of the Sailing School Disabilities family. Yeah, it's, it's been five years since we had a major sponsor, so, you know, we've eaten into cash reserves. To continue offering these programs and to build new and innovative ways of looking at things, we need your help, we need your support. The Collective, the North Sydney Collective is a great opportunity for us all to come together and develop a product that can be exported all over Australia, maybe all over the world. But it's this innovative type thinking that we need. It's synonymous with SWD and we're very, very proud to be part of this and looking forward to the positive outcomes that I'm sure will come from this. We're trying to change the way we do things, the way that society perceives disabled people and the way that the whole society becomes richer because we accept that challenge of making things better. We all win. Australia becomes the richer. Five years ago I was in a wheelchair and uh, I was disabled for 15 years in and out of a wheelchair and yeah, not, not real happy with life and then Sailors with Disabilities came into Coffs Harbour and they said that I could sail and I thought you know, that's pretty damn awesome. Here I am five years later, out of my wheelchair, off my crutches, off my brace, and I'm sailing. It a lot. I love it. I get to play with some of the most dynamic spirits on the planet every day of my life. I mean, what a, what a gift.